Welcome. I want to thank Pastor Mike for asking me to fill in this week while he and his family are at Burning Man. I'm going to be preaching on a story we're all familiar with, the story of David and Goliath. It's a story we can turn to when we're facing our own giants. Maybe it's doubt, maybe it's addiction, maybe it's our own pride. But one thing we all get wrong about this story is it was not David who defeated Goliath, it was God. Amen. Hallelujah. Yeah, um, if we turn to Samuel 1747, we find that David himself gives God the credit, saying the battle belongs to the Lord. Praise the Lord! Lady, I'm trying to preach up here. L lady, my name is Evelyn. Oh, are you sure it's not Pastor Evelyn? Because you're talking more than I am. But I, I, I just felt the spirit. No, oh, I just felt the spirit. Man, now I know why Paul ordered women to shut up in church. Uh, uh, okay. As I was saying, like David, we sinners are capable of doing no good on our own, except through the work of God in us. Hallelujah! This lady's got me feeling like Balaam in Numbers 22 up here. What does that mean? Well, I've got an ass that keeps talking. Pastor Mike lets me say hallelujah. Yeah, well, Pastor Mike ain't here this week. Maybe he puts up with your crap, but I don't. He just said ass and crap in church. Evelyn, be quiet. If the words aren't in bold in your bulletin, you don't have to say them. I think Evelyn might be drunk. No communion for her. I am not drunk. My husband was taken from the bottle. Oh, yeah, well, then why don't you come up here and talk about Goliath? You look like you're old enough to have met him. <laughs> I'm 83. Uh-oh, I think a Walmart is missing its greeter. I have been coming to this church for over 30... Uh, that's enough, Grandma Moses. Ushers, get her out of here. What? I'm not... No! No! <laughs> Jesus, forgive these men, Jesus. Hey, was anybody recording this? I am so putting this on TikTok. <laughs>